Hello and welcome back to my Minecraft Survival Let's Play series. Today we're picking up kind of from where we left off in the last episode. I have done some stuff off camera, some work, because today we are going to be invading the Ocean Monument. Finally, the day is here where we will be doing that. Now you might remember in the last episode, if you did see the last episode, that we enchanted our diamond armor and also our lovely tools here. But if you noticed, the armor no longer has enchantments on. And if you didn't know, if you're not on my Discord server, you would not have seen that I did a poll on there, a vote, to reset the armor enchantments. Now, the reason why I did that was because there was a bug, two bugs. One of the bugs were where you would get multiple types of protection stacked on top of each other. So like the chest plate, I don't remember what it had, but let's say it had fire protection and blast protection, and that is normally not doable. So that was a bug that happened. And another thing that happened was, I don't remember if it was only unbreaking or other enchantments as well, where you would only get level one. And I think we did get like level one fire protection or something, or level one unbreaking. And that's kind of meh when you get to level 30 and then you get a 30 level enchantment and you get on breaking one out. So yeah, that uh, that has now been fixed. We're playing in 1.14.3 by the way. So yeah. Um, so I did a vote out there to reset the armor and so I did. I didn't do anything else of course. I only um, reset the armor so it no longer has enchantments and gave me back the experience that I used for the armor. So I guess we should start with doing that. But before we get started on that, let me just get it away. I made some potions for our mission, which we'll be looking at in a bit. Let me just grab my Lapis Lazuli here, so we will be needing 12 in total. Oh, also I did some changes to this section, by the way. Um, Yeah, I moved the chests, I think, I think it was Spice Mines, I'll try and put the comment up on screen right now, that suggested putting the chests up from the floor and also replacing this with a hidden light source, which I tried, but I didn't really see a difference. So maybe I'm just doing something wrong or something. I, I don't know. But um, but yeah, if I eh, if I get back up here, remove the torches, I don't really see like there's, there's lighting up there at all. So I don't know, it's probably just me not doing it right. But anyways, I moved the chest up and I moved the animal over here instead of I think I placed it there. Anyways, let's get on to it. Let's start with the helmet. Uh, respiration 3, that's pretty good. Ooh, protection four, unbreaking three, respiration three. That is really good. Let's move on to ooh, thorns one. Protection three, unbreaking three, thorns one. These are the enchantments I like to see on armor. Protection four, okay, wish that had protection. Uh, unbreaking, sorry, but we'll see. Uh, blast protection, we just gotta go for it. Blast protection and death strider. So two pieces of armor that doesn't have unbreaking three yet. We will upgrade that eventually, but anyways, it doesn't matter, we could always get more diamonds and repair it and get books, etc. We will be using this armor today when going on this adventure as well as the the um the sword here. I don't think um Ooh, I want silk touch but I can't get it. <laughs> okay, you know what? That will just have to wait for another time. Let's take a look at the potions. I don't think there's anything else I need to prepare for because I don't have the experience to do so. So I made some potions. We'll definitely need the water breathing. And in fact, while I remember it, there is some specific potions that I wanted to make that I forgot about. Give me my carrots here. Give me two. And that is light vision potion because I do believe, yes, they do make things a little bit easier to to see stuff underwater. So let me just get my gold nuggets here and create two golden carrots and put one in there and put one in there. Awesome. Wrong barrel. Okay. But the in potions that I have been making, I've been making regeneration potions and also instant health potion. I don't think we'll need that many, but just in case we will have them. Let me just get my redstone ready because we want this to last for as long as possible. And boom, there we go. And there we go. Um, we have speed potions. I didn't make those. We have the water breathing potions, which of course we will be using. I do not expect to be down there for more than 8, 16 and 24 minutes. But just in case I'll bring all of them. And will I die? Hopefully not. But we shall see. You know what? Let's just grab all of these out right away. Um, I don't expect to be needing all of this, but 
better safe than sorry. I will take speed. I don't know if it will have an effect, but at least we'll be able to get over there faster. I'll take all the water breathing potions as well, just as a precaution. Um, night vision potions aren't necessary, but they're nice to have. I'll take three of them with me and store the other three here. Um, I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, Iron Pig we got the diamond sword, we got the diamond armor, we can throw that away. Uh, we don't really need the bow or anything, but let's just keep it. We got plenty of food, plenty of torches. I think that we are good to go. Um, yeah. I think that we are good to go. So let us take off this ugly, disgusting iron armor. In fact, let us put it up over here. Um, Ah, that was a new this put. Okay, that was not from me putting these on here with the with the head, but that was such a coincidence. Wow, okay. Actually, let me show you. I finally ducked back here because there was actually a cave here. It took it took some searching, but I managed to find it. Uh, wow, I really blocked this up tight, didn't I? Yeah, as you can see, there was actually a cave here. And it took a while to find, but it actually leads outside. So, I mean, that's that's cool. I think I explored all of it. Nothing much. I think I found some gold or something. I'm not sure. But, yeah, that, that was here. And that's where the mob sounds and such were. So, that's cool, I guess. That's fun. I need to fill this out eventually. Um, but yes, let us just put that back. And where is my terracotta chest? Okay. Yeah, let's get the diamond armor on and let us get going. There we go. Wonderful. Look at that. I think we are ready for war. I wonder, can you actually give normal enchantments to the shield? Not the potion, the shield. No, you need to use books for that. Okay, that's fine. Um, yeah, I think we're good. I don't think I need anything else whatsoever. Uh, when is the sun going down? Pretty soon. Hmm, I don't think I have a bed. You know what? Let me bring a bed with me and I'll run over to the place we need to be because then we can sleep over there. I should have a spare bed actually. Hold on. Yeah, I do have a spare bed. Cool. All right, we'll place one at the fishing hut that we made a while back because we will be going over there. That's right, that's so cool. All right, let's get up. And I know for a fact that it is, I believe in this direction. Let me drink a speed potion here so that this will go a little bit faster. I could actually have gotten a speed two potion, but you know what, it's fine. All right, I'm gonna get over there and get settled and get a bit down and sleep just in case we die. And uh, yeah, I'll see you when I get there, so stay tuned. All right, we're back. I have just slept and it is now day, so let us get in the boat and get over to where we need to be. It is over in this direction. We were here once when we explored a little bit. Um, I don't remember when that was, but we were over here and explored and we found this really cool ice biome. And it so happens that there is an ocean monument actually in the middle of it, so... Yeah, we'll just get over there and take a look at this thing. So, I don't remember exactly where it was, but I'm pretty sure it was over here somewhere. Yep, there it is. We can see it right there. There it is. The entrance is right over here. Now, I could use TNT and blast my way through, but I'm not going to do that, because I want to do it the good old-fashioned way. So, let us get the night vision and... Um, water breathing out, but I just want to get down there real close, real quick. You know what? Let's get the let's get the night vision and observe. As you can see, I didn't want that to have water in it. There we go. Yes, we got some guardians outside, but look at that. That's pretty cool with the ice floating on top of it. That's really nice. All right, the entrance is right there. I think we should just go for it. Also, there's a shipwreck over there. I'm not sure if I've been there. Um. Also there, actually. Huh, should use time duration more often when, when sailing. <laughs> All right, let's get to water breathing. So 
so we don't have to worry about that. And let's get down into it. Equip shield, and we are going to war. In this episode, we are starting a war. Okay, so this thing is basically like a maze. Oh, this step strider is so good. Yeah, it's basically just like a maze here. Up ah, there we go. Minor fatigue. Minor fatigue. Okay. So yeah, this thing is pretty much just like a maze, and I wanna... Oh, there's the center of it. There's the center with the treasure. Okay. That's good to know. Oh, there's a sponge room. Yes. I was hoping for one of those. Okay. Wow, the volume is a little bit loud to me. Let me just turn it down. There we go. Might need to turn it down for you guys as well. Okay, let's take a look here. I need to find the Elder Guardian so we can get rid of this minor fatigue, because that will be a pain. Let's see if I can find this fella. As I said, it is literally like a maze down here. So like, yeah, need to be a little bit careful not to get lost, especially with minor fatigue, because can't really just, um, I came from this way, didn't I? Yeah, I did. See what I mean? We can't really just dig our way out. Okay. I have no idea where I'm going. Okay, that's a dead end with those guys. Um, go this way. Oh. Where's this? Okay, that is the center room. Oh, there's the first one. There's the first one. Okay, okay. So, from what I know, when the spikes are out, that is when they do damage to you when you hit them. Like thorns, basically. But when they're not out, that's when you can hit them and they don't do damage to you. So, like, now. Okay, ow. Yeah, that's using up the armor there. Ow. Ow. Break the line of sight. So, they shoot these laser beams out and... It is not nice. Ow. Okay. I wonder if the shield blocks it. No, it doesn't. The shield is fairly useless in this scenario. Yeah. Gotta be a little bit careful, because that will do damage to the armor. Let's take the shield off, in fact, because can't really see anything. Um, okay, so that was the first one. There's three in total. I wonder... Okay, so that was the center one. Now we need to find the side ones. Let me go... Oh, oh lag. A little bit lag. Let's go over here and see if we can find anything. No, this just goes around. I think. This is a room thing here, or just a pillar. It's just a pillar. Okay. That works. And a lot of guardians. Okay. You know what, guys? I'm out. See ya. Is this? That's another sponge room. Nice. Two of them. Um, okay. So, this didn't help much. Nope. <laughs> I may or may not be... Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's so many of them here. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold everything. Get me out of here. Get me out. Get me out. Give me a moment. Okay. Um, okay, there's a lot in there. A lot of normal guardians and the elder guardian. You know what? I'm just gonna go for the elder guardian. Hopefully break all of their lines of sight. This is not gonna go well, is it? I'm gonna get a regeneration potion going here. Cause yeah, might need it. It's gonna last for a minute or so. Can't see anything here. Oh yeah, yeah. Owie, 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 owie. Okay. Just need to kill this guy. I'm gonna try and f swim around them all, hopefully to break their line of sight. Okay. Ow. Okay. I think I did it. Wait, I didn't get the sponge he dropped. Ah, that is. Okay, I want the sponges. Those are cool. Okay. Now we are just missing one more guardian and this place will be ours. So there should be one at this part of the of the um of the thing. That's just an empty room. Okay. Nothing going up. 
What's this then? Nothing. Okay. Gotta find a thing that goes over in this direction. Sure this is just an empty room? Yes, okay. This might take a while to find. But um I will find it eventually. There he is. I found him. There he is, the big fella. Ow. It really does damage to the armor, doesn't it? Go down. Yeah, you know what, fella? You're just gonna die. I can repair my armor. You can't be repaired. There we go. That is all of that. Now I still have two minutes of... Are you gonna do... Are you gonna do that too? Are you? Are you really? No? Thought so. Okay, that is the... Big Guardian's gone. We have three sponges from that, so now I'm basically just waiting for the um, minor fatigue to go away and, well, we can do whatever we want here. I'm not sure what to do. I don't have silk touch. I would love these right here, um, the sea lanterns, but I don't have silk touch and I want them with silk touch. So I don't think I'm actually going to take much from this place, but the treasure, which I know what it is, it's gold gold blocks so yeah not much there but it was fun I still wanted to raid this place just because I think it's pretty cool and I might want to use it eventually ah that goes my night vision okay this room is very very dark get out of my face okay oh, okay there's a lot down here no thanks no thanks no thanks uh, now I just need to find my way out again yeah yeah I'm drinking another night vision potion. And I think I'm just gonna wait here till the minor fatigue wears off, actually. Oh no, I need another water breathing. Last thing I wanna do is drown down here. That would be bad. All right, the minor fatigue is gone. I can now break things. Now I have no idea what breaks this the best. I'm guessing shears would. Yeah. Definitely think shears would break break this the unless it's swords. Nope. Not pickaxes. Not axes, not shovels. Hmm. I might actually go home, empty my inventory, and get some shears. Cause um yeah. I would like to get the the sponge from this place, but I don't wanna mine it for two hours. So I might go ahead and do that if I can find my way out again. Ah, here's the big room. Let's at least get the treasure before we leave. All right, let us um, let me break this. I don't have aqua affinity either on the helmet, so that's gonna make working underwater a lot harder. What do I get if I break this just like this? Prismarine crystals, which can be used to make them. I th they can be used to make them, but. I think it requires actual prismarine as well. Let me see, I have six. Do I just get ten then? I should get ten. No, two. Okay, I'm not gonna break them. I'm not gonna break them then. Alright. There we go, there's the gold. Alright, so I think I will be get back down here another time where I have... Nobody. Where I have aqua affinity on my helmet. And where I have a better pickaxe than this, because I want to get some of these blocks down here. And guys, let me know actually, should I make a guardian farm? I don't know how much of the prismarine I would use in builds, but it would be definitely nice to have. Um, it's... Hi, buddy. You know, I kind of want this guy as a pet now, because he's not trying to kill me. He's just letting me be at this point. That's actually pretty cool. He's telling me not to get the gold, I think. Or he just wants out. There we go. That's cool. <laughs> Alright, eight blocks of gold. That's actually... That's enough to make an orch apple. That's enough to make an enchanted golden apple or an, a orch apple. Where on earth did I come from? Don't tell me I have to re-watch the recording <laughs> to get out. Pretty sure it was... Ah, there we go. Okay, let me get out before...
before I get killed by all of these guys. Okay. Ah, it's night time. We made it. Skeleton, you... Oh, drowned. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Not sure what to do right now. I think... I think I will actually craft this chainmail chest plate just because you can't craft chainmail. Um, I will leave this monument here for now until I get Aqua Affinity and a pickaxe with Unbreaking and Silk Touch so I can get some of the blocks down here. But we got the eight gold blocks. So I guess the question is now, should I use, should I save these gold blocks or should I use them to make the enchanted golden apple. I don't know. Let me know what you think down below. Also, let me know if you think I should make a guardian farm. I don't know what I would use it for, but I guess it's a cool way of getting XP or just making a farm in general. I think it's a pretty big project. But um, yeah, let me know what you think down below. Let me just see if there's anything in this boat thing while we still have um, water breathing. Oh, there was. Okay, um, I don't care about the other stuff, you know what, to be honest, I'm more interested in the glass bottles because I got multiple stacks of, of lapis. Alright, let me just loot some of this stuff and I'll meet you back home, so stay tuned. Well, I got a fishing rod with mending, that's pretty cool. And here we are, back home, that was, okay, to be honest, that was actually... A lot quicker than I had thought it would be, because I I thought it would have taken a lot longer than that, but um, it didn't. <laughs> it really, really didn't. I'm actually surprised. I'm gonna take these wet sponges up here and dry them so I can use them. I'm gonna keep these right here just because they're a little bit special, and we might want to use them to make a um. To make an enchanted golden apple, I think I actually already have one, but making one would be pretty cool. Yeah, I already have one, but making one would be pretty cool. Um, let me put these glass water bottles away here, because I don't need those. Put the potions away. I also need to upgrade my storage area here, because every chest is now filled with something, and I want to utilize the barrels, I think, a little bit more, and yeah, making it look a little bit prettier. So I think I will be doing that probably off camera to be honest. Oh, I have another potion of regeneration. There we go. A mending fishing rod, that's cool. Um, let's get the iron in here. All right, cool. Well, I think that's gonna do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't yet and enable those notifications. Also share it with your friends, of course. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed and feel free to join my Discord server linked down below. Follow me on Twitter and also follow me on Twitch for non-Minecraft streams. Oh, and of course, let me know what you think we should do with the ocean monument that is, has now been raided. Should we just loot it or should we, I guess, loot it and make it into a guardian farm? Let me know what you think. But anyways, also with the gold blocks, should we make an energetic gold apple or just use the gold for something else? Anyways, hope you enjoyed and hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.